Lou, and I am here uh, doing an interview, the weirdest interview I've ever done, but uh, I'm very excited about it. I am standing with... Katie. Katie, and Katie is caged. It's caged Katie, and she's at Exotica. Katie, what are you doing in this cage? I like it in here. <laughs> so she likes it in here, okay. How do you like Exotica so far? What's going on? How are you enjoying it? I'm having a blast. I love how many people have dressed up, and they come in like, oh my gosh, there's so many people, they're almost naked. <laughs> I know, I know. I, listen, I gained some weight, and so now I got a midriff on. If you, uh, but I haven't been showing it. But there's a little bit of skin. I'm showing too. Very nice. All right, so uh, Exotica 2022, you came out here. Uh, what are you looking forward to at Exotica this year? I really am looking forward to seeing Rubber Doll perform later. So I follow her on OnlyFans and Twitter. I'm a big fan. Oh, okay. Do you have your own OnlyFans? Ooh, do you want to share the OnlyFans with the people? I just started a couple months ago. <laughs> so. Are cages involved? Yes, but they're usually on people's penises. Ooh, I think Caged Katie is a great moniker. That's a good one. That could make you a lot of money. Probably right. Give me a finder's fee, you know what I'm saying? Like, just give me a little, a little off the top for that. All right, I love Katie in the cage. I got a question for you. When I said I was coming to Exotica, everybody asked me a question, and I thought I'd ask it to the people who are going here, and that question is, what's it smell like? Body odor. It smells like body odor. Hopefully she wasn't talking to me because I got my arm up. Hopefully she didn't mean me. Did you mean me? Hell no, no, no. I smell great. I smell great. All right. Really what's your favorite thing to do in the cage? Ooh, you like the voyeuristic aspect of it, right? I do. I'm an exhibitionist for sure. Okay. Well, shoot. This has been an amazing exhibition. I don't want to take up more of your time. Uh, we figured out what it. Oh wait, I did. I, I asked you what it smells like. You said body odor. Uh, that was great. And then, uh, what's the last question I want to ask? Give me a good one. Hold on. What should I ask you last, Katie? What should I ask you last? What's What's something that no one has asked you yet at Exotica that you want to be asked? Stumper. It's a head scratcher. I'm definitely stumped, yeah. <laughs> What's something that you hope someone comes up and asks you? You're like, ooh, I wish somebody would ask me to do what? Oh, I wish a really hot girl would come and play with me and my guy. We've been wearing the little uh, bracelet for the swingers. Wait, there's a swingers bracelet? Pull that out. Show it. I don't have it on me. Okay. Well, he doesn't have it on me. Either. Okay. If you wear blue, you're a newbie. If you wear pink, you're bisexual. And if you wear green, you're down to swap or whatever. Wait, so, so there's bracelets color-coded yes. for swinging here. Yes, but I keep looking for people with the bracelets and trying to say hi. Nobody's saying hi to me, so I probably like I'm not wearing my bracelet. Do you think it could be because you're in a cage? Yeah, that might have something to do with it. <laughs> that might have a little bit to do with it. All right, Katie in the cage. We're having super fun at Exotica 2022. You need to get here next year. Where can they find you, Katie? You can find me online on Twitter. It's Mistress Katie Seven. I know I look submissive today. It's a special occasion. Usually, y'all better be careful. I'll smack you. Ooh, she's into the smacking. So don't get smacked. Visit Mistress Katie, bro. I think she should change it to Cage Katie. But we'll see what happens. All right. Yeah. For the NRW, I've been Glenn Lawrence. I'm out.